Hey, Patrick Franta here again, principal of the Villa Group. Just wanted to chat with you guys real quick about what's going on in the market. We just got the April numbers in. Um, before I do that, just wanted to give you a little breakdown. Um, we just popped out of the office here from the Wailea Beach Villas and wanted to let you know what's going on in there. We um, got two phenomenal offerings in here right now. We've got a second floor penthouse that is listed at just over four and a half, and that's probably gonna be one of your better investment opportunities in Wailea right now. Absolutely phenomenal revenues. You have some nice views from that unit, and it's absolutely spectacular property. We've also got a third floor penthouse listed at just over seven and a half million. A little bit larger square footage, three bedrooms, absolutely best of the best when you're looking at my Leia condo inventory. Um, we did also just close an absolutely phenomenal property, a villa in the D building. Um, beautifully redone, spectacular finishes, and we closed that just at 12 million, even about a month ago. And that's one of the highest comps in the complex ever off the ocean. But not a front row. Um, now I wanted to take you to Wailea as a whole. So we're down here on the beautiful beach path and you know obviously we've got all this phenomenal inventory. What's happening in Wailea as a whole? So we've got single family inventory right now is at a record low number. If you've been looking for a home in Wailea, I'm sure you've noticed there's not a lot to buy. Um, because of that reason, our median numbers have actually dropped recently. So now we're sitting at just over 3 million for a median when last year at this time, the median was 4.2. So primarily inventory driven, not, you know, I, I know the numbers look off, but it's mainly inventory based. Um, condos still looking healthy, inventory has remained a little more balanced with our median sitting at one and a half, just over one and a half. Um, that's about a 12 to 14% increase over last year. Um, so that's kind of more what you'd typically expect. The inventory has not been as limited in the condo arena. Um, Maui as a whole, what's going on there? So our median now, we're at 115 for a median on single family. That's up about 18% year over year. Condos just over 750. Um, it's about 20-ish, 22. So that's kind of the growth we've been seeing recently. Um, you know, what are our thoughts, right? I'll, I'll kind of cut to the short and sweet. Um, Right now, pending volumes, we are seeing some decreases there. Um, what does that mean for the broader market? Hopefully we see a little more balance, right? We've had an incredibly hot market, really restricted inventory. And now with those pendings decreasing, hopefully some of that inventory opens up and we'll see more opportunities for our buyers. Um, you know, we have a lot of volatility out there in the world. So, you know, stock market's been all over the place. There are, you know, some geopolitical pressures happening so you know what the rest of the year holds into 2023 is hard to say but I think expect a little more balance um, for our sellers definitely if you've been thinking about it this is the time um, we're gonna see you know a little less leverage in the near future here for the buyers um, got kind of two things going on we expect inventory to open up a little bit but rates are also going up so you know, depending on what your priorities are and, you know, how quick you want to get in, I would keep your eyes on the market and we'll help you find the best deal available. All right, we'll talk to you next month, guys. Aloha.